Hey, y'all. Pissed off Redneck here. Now, you know what? Today's Monday. Martin Luther King Day. So some of you people might be off work. My sons are bitches. Kids are off school. Blah, blah, blah. You know. So, uh, bank, no banks open. No post office. Wanted to go get my, check my, uh, YouTube mail today. Couldn't even go do that. Sons of bitches. Um. Okay. I've been getting a lot of requests to do a prank phone call. So I'm going to try a prank phone call today. Let's see how this works out. Thank you for calling McDonald's. For anything related to employment at McDonald's, or for information on obtaining a W-2 form, please press 1. McDonald's customers, please press 2. Well, hey, uh, I, you know what, I have, um, I have a couple things, like two or three things I need to talk to you about, about, um, a couple experiences I had in your restaurants. Okay, could you go ahead and tell me about that, please? Okay, the first one, I was in, um, a restaurant, I don't even remember where the hell it was at, but, uh, I, let me think, it was in, um, do you know where, uh, in Chardon, Ohio. It was in Chardon, Ohio. I was going through there, and I stopped in there, and uh, they were having a kid's birthday party in there. I didn't know you guys still did that. Uh-huh. Yeah, well, they were having a uh, kid's birthday party in there, and uh, the parents were having a party, and I guess they were waiting on old Ronald to show up. When he showed up, he scared the hell out of me about shit my pants, and then, because I didn't think you guys did that anymore. And then... Um, they were playing ACDC, black, Back in Black, uh, like a radio. And that girl just stood up and started dancing. And um, it was kind of loud. And I, I, I didn't appreciate that. I needed, you know, I've been driving all night. I wanted to stop and just get a cup of coffee and something to eat. And I didn't think you guys did those birthday parties anymore. Okay, and the operator's decision, you know, to do that. So, you know, unfortunately, I can't speak for all of the restaurants, but for this matter, it looks like that restaurant has actually done it. And so, uh, let's see here. Well, first of all, I just want to say something. I'm not calling to try to get anything free. I'm not asking for any kind of compensation for my troubles or anything. I don't want that. I'm just calling to give a, you know, give a little feedback. Yeah, that sounds about right. Okay. Let me go ahead and document this all down for you. Oh, right. And when was this experience? Um, you know what? It was either, um, let me think here. It was, it was either um, Friday or Saturday. To be honest with you, can I tell you something? Uh-huh. I, I was high. I smoked, I, I smoked medical marijuana. And when I got done driving, before I went to get something to eat to help my appetite, you know, I sparked one up. So um, I think it was probably, I think it was Saturday. Okay, thank you. Do you know what, around what time that would have been? Oh, hell. Um... Yeah, I'm going to say it's probably around 6 o'clock in the evening. Thank you very much for that. And so uh, what I am going to go ahead and do is immediately share this information. It would be with the owner's organization for you so that he or she you know, would be able to go ahead and address that for you. And in case I do have further questions, may I go ahead and start by gathering your first and last name, please? Well, I do have some other questions. Okay. What about that McRib? Why do you guys still have that? That thing so that some bitch is so messy. Last time I ate that, it dripped all over in front of me. And you know, again, even ninety percent of our restaurants are actually franchise owned, so that is actually one of those items that it is a franchise owned, you know, decision to bring them in. Oh, really? So all of McDonald's don't serve them. Right, and so you know, 
some restaurants, some franchisees, we know, say that they don't want to sell them. So, you know, they won't carry them, but others, you know, may. Well, I was, yeah, I was wondering about that. Now, the other thing is, uh, um, because I, I'm out on the road a lot, and I, I stop at, you know, McDonald's a lot, too, sometimes, because it's fast and easy, like, uh, my ex-wife, but, um, now, let me, uh, oh, now, another one I stopped in, and this was in Pennsylvania, around Pittsburgh somewhere, uh, they called me a fat ass. That's not K. And I, I didn't think that's part of your guys' training. Right, no, completely. You should always be receiving that from your professional service. And where did you say that this restaurant was located? You uh, know, you know no, no, I don't. It was right around Pittsburgh. They called me a fat ass. I, I got pissed. I asked to talk to a manager. I said, that's not K. You can't call me that. I said, apparently you think it is K. And they, uh... They said there was no manager there, and they told me that I can go look up the number and call them tomorrow. I, to be honest with you, now I'm starting to wonder why I even go to McDonald's anymore. Every time I go, I've been having a problem. You guys took my favorite sandwich away, and then, you know, I go birthday party, Blair and ACDC, that girl dance on table. And now, uh, now, now I called, hey, you need to get some information. They called me a fat ass, too, and that wasn't good. My first name's Hoppy. H O P P I. Okay, so last name. You know what? I changed my last name. I I I don't have a last name. I my name's Hoppy. You know, like uh, when um, P Diddy changed his name or whatever the hell, mm-hmm. Puff Daddy. He just t- changed it to Diddy. I changed mine to Hoppy on a bet. Somebody bet me I couldn't do it, and they're going to give me three grand if I could do it, and I did it. I made three grand. No, I don't do that email. Last time I did email, ISIS stole it, and they tried buying um, they tried buying rocket launchers and shit right from my email, and then they tried to investigate me for it, and I I just got rid of all that stuff. I don't trust anything on the interwebs anymore. Oh right, and you know I do apologize. So you know I will go ahead and document that you don't have an email. That's fine, all right. You don't gotta apologize. You don't gotta apologize. You don't have to apologize. No, you don't have to apologize. You're not ISIS. You didn't steal my email. Okay. And like I said, I'm not trying to get any compensation. I'm not trying to get anything free. I just wanted to call and share my thoughts. Right. No, I do completely understand it. It is appreciated, Happy, actually, that you have taken the time out of your day to give us a call today. So thank you very much for doing so. You know, I will go ahead and get this immediately shared with the owner's organization. So would you like me to put in a request that they do contact you back in regards to your experience? That You know what? That's okay. I, I trust you. You seem like a nice person. Mm-hmm. Did you vote? Now, this is a little personal. Do you vote for Hillary or Trump? You know, I'm sorry. I don't, you know, want to speak on that. Oh, okay. I, I'm picking up what you're laying down. I hear you. All right. <laughs> All right, well, yeah, I guess that's it. Are we done here? Okay, yeah, I do just want to offer as a brief five-question survey on how I handled your call today. Happy if you could take that for me. I'd be very appreciated. You go ahead and send me over to it. All right, thank you. You enjoy the rest of your day, okay? You too. Hey, okay, thank you. <sighs> okay, everybody, that was kind of a prank call. I, I think I know I've done better. Now... But, you know, I try to keep this with PG for the YouTubes. So, there you go. Now, please, subscribe to my channel. I need subscribers. Hit that thumbs up some bit. Give me a like. Share my damn videos. Share them. Get them out there. And uh, follow me on Twitter, Hoppy69. Also, send me some YouTube mail. And, uh, I'll put the Twitter link and my, U- or my damn P.O. box in the description. I'm all shooken up here and um my sons of bitches i love you guys i appreciate you guys i'm always thankful for you guys i'm taking 
I love you guys. You guys have a great rest of your day. I'm just scatterbrained right now. Um, I'm out. My son's a bitch.